Hello and welcome to the Thurgood Associates short video on the new visualization tools in Tableau 8. My name is Matthew Keene and I'm a consultant with Thurgood Associates. Uh, Thurgood is a partner of Tableau and we help our enterprise customers to get the most out of this data visualizations tool. Today in this demo we're going to walk through the new marks card uh, and how it is much more flexible and user friendly in Tableau 8 than it was in Tableau 7. We're going to go through the new tree map visualization and how this gives a new perspective on viewing data. We're also going to go through the enhanced data labels, including the rich text editor that's available in Tableau 8, uh, as well as going through freeform dashboards and how they help to utilize uh, the screen real estate in a dashboard in Tableau. So now let's jump right into the demonstration. So we have Tableau Desktop open here, and what I want to do is create a quick visualization that compares the countries uh, and regions of my data set in terms of profit and sales. So what I'm going to do is quickly drag the country region onto the columns. I'm going to drag sales onto my rows as well as profit. And we can see this creates a quick bar chart that allows us to interpret the data. However, um, if we click on the Show Me tab here, this tab in Tableau takes into account what dimensions and measures you have in your visualization and suggests some other visualizations. So we see the tree map here, which, uh, which I said was a new visualization. I'm just going to click on this, and we can see that Tableau automatically rearranges our dimensions and measures into the new marks card here. Uh, and we have this new visualization, which shows that the United States of America is very clearly leading in our profit and our sales as well. Now let's say I also want to see my sales and profit broken out by continent. I can do this easily by dragging and dropping continent under the rows. Now if I sort these, I can see very simply that Asia is my leading continent in sales and profitability, where North America is second. In order to make this visualization even more powerful, I'm going to color my tree map by both continent and country region. Uh, to do this, I'm going to drag them both onto the color attribute, and this is a new aspect of Tableau 8 where you can force that color attribute in the marks card to house more than one dimension. So what I'm going to do is drag and drop continent into color, and I'm also going to make sure I click on country region before I hit control shift, hold those down, and drag and drop country region onto there as well. Uh, after I sort these, we can see very simply that now our tree map is organized by profit as well as colored by country and continent. Now to make my visualization even more descriptive, I'm going to drop some labels on it. I'm going to drop the sales onto the label. I'm also going to drop my profit onto the label. And you can see them appear on the, on the tree map there. Uh, and I'm going to use the rich text editor now uh, by just clicking on that label. I'm going to make my country region bold and I'm going to increase that text to 10 point font just so I can see it better. I'm also going to label my sales and my profit because even though I know the order that I drag them on in, uh, people who are viewing my visualization may not. So if I apply this here, you can see that it was that easy to edit the text in the rich text editor. Now that my tree map is complete, I want to add this visualization to a dashboard. I have this sales by geography dashboard made up and uh, first I'm just going to drag my sales by continent onto here. I'm going to delete this legend to make some more room and just fit the entire width with my tree map. You can see a lot of unused screen real estate in the bottom right here. If I want to add another object to this dashboard, previously in Tableau I would have to drag and drop in this tiled manner, which as you can see wastes a lot of screen real estate. However, in Tableau 8, you can switch to add sheet objects as floating. And in this way, I can drag and drop the sales map on here that I've made up and really utilize all of the screen real estate on my dashboard. Another really interactive thing we can do with our dashboard is we can make the sales by continent tree map a filter by clicking use as filter here. And now, if I go in and select North America for my tree map, we see that selection also propagate to my sales map. This concludes our demo. Thank you very much for tuning in to Thoroughgood's take on the new visualizations in Tableau 8. If you have any questions about Tableau or how Thoroughgood can help your business, please do not hesitate to email me at matthew.keen at thoroughgood.com or visit our website www.thoroughgood.com.